of somebody. He is truly worthy to be praised. It is a wonderful thing to be in worship. The Bible says, forsake not the assembling of yourselves together. And wherever you are, that's where the church is. Hello, somebody. I said, wherever you are, that's where the church is. And so we bless our God. We give him glory. We give him honor. And we do give him praise. And for those of us who are in the sanctuary today, we bless God even the more that he has granted us this awesome privilege. Hallelujah. To be in the house of prayer one more time. We thank God. We thank Him for His goodness. We thank Him for God. His graciousness. I want to just take a moment and just acknowledge Mr. Paul Taylor. We're glad that He has <laughs> taken the opportunity to come and share with us to be in support of what we're doing here uh, at Macedonia. And we just bless God. We glorify Him. We thank Him. I want to just encourage you for a moment just before uh, uh, Prophetess Larry comes with our prayer uh, that, that there is so much going on in our world today and, and not only is those persons who are selling goods uh, like hand sanitizer and masks are taking advantage of the circumstances that we are faced with but Satan is also yes, yes. I said Satan is also taking advantage of the circumstances so I want to tell the people of the household of faith, hold on to your faith. Yes. Yes. Uh, keep trusting in the Lord. Yes. Lean not to your own understanding. Yes. In all your ways acknowledge him, and yes. he shall direct yes. your heart. Yes. Yes. I don't care what it looks like. I don't care if the sun does not come up in the morning. God is still God. Yes, sir. Ah, yes, sir. He can do anything but fail. Yes, so I want to encourage you today to hold to God's unchanging hand. Yes, Trust in Him and never doubt Him. Yes. And I declare that He will surely, I said He will surely bring yes. us you yes. out. Amen. Amen. Yes. Come on, Prophet Larry. We bless God. We magnify his holy and righteous name in this house today. Hallelujah. 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 Right where you are, won't you just begin to build an altar unto the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's worthy. Hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. That wonderful and matchless name, Jesus. The one that gives us access into your presence, God. Yes. The one that allows us to just come boldly before your throne and find grace in our time of need. Lord, we thank you right now that you've given us a name that's above every other name. Yes. That at the name of Jesus, every demon must tremble, every yeah, name yeah. must bow. Yes. At the name of Jesus. Yes. Lord, we can speak so many other things, but if we just just call on your name. Oh, Everything God. changes. The atmosphere yes. changes. The lifestyle changes, yes. God. If we begin to call on your name in our times of trouble and distress, Lord God, we get peace. And so, God, we declare that your name, God, is great. Yes. And it's greatly to be praised. We declare that you are the Messiah. Yes. We declare that you are King of yes. Earth and Lord. then and you've got it under control now. God, we tell you, thank you right now that we're in a season of new God. Hallelujah. We're seeing things that we've never seen before, Lord God, but it's all according to your plan, all according to your power, and all according to your purpose. So therefore, we give you glory, God. We give you honor, God. We give you praise, God. We know that you are God, and besides you, there is no other. You are fighting for us, God, and we tell on our side, God, and if you be for us, yes. who can be against us? And so, Lord, we declare and dec decree that this is our time of our shaking of devotion unto you. Yes. Lord, we love you, God. We honor you. We adore you, Lord God. We create a space and an atmosphere for you to move, Lord God, oh God. for you to do what you do, Lord God.
God. And so we want you to carry them, God. We want to give them back to you, Lord God. We don't want them, God. They only weigh us down and keep us from doing, oh God, what you called us to do. Yes, so God, you, you carry the burden, God. Yes, you God. take it, God. How? God, you take it, Lord God. And we give it to you, Lord we God. We release it to you, Lord God. Yes, God. We thank you right thank now, you, God, because we're casting our burdens on you, Lord God. That we can take authority, oh God. We can take authority, Lord God, over things, oh God, that may be taking place. So right now, in the name in of Jesus, name. we take authority, Lord God, over sickness, God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We declare and decree if there is any sick among us. We declare and decree that they are in, in the name. Order this ease, God. We yes. declare and decree that they have a sound mind in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord God, that every disease, high blood pressure, asthma is under the blood of Jesus. We thank you, Father God, that we can count on your blood, God, because it's backed by your name, God. Thank you, Lord God. You said if we ask anything in your name, it shall be done, God. And we tell you, thank you right now, God, that you're moving, oh God, and that you've given us that power. God, and you've given us the authority, oh God, to wield your name as a weapon of warfare, God. And we tell you, thank you right now, God, that Jesus reigns, Jesus rules. You are the supreme God. You are the one and only God. Hot, God, high and lifted up, God. High and lifted up. High and lifted up. You are God. Hallelujah, God. You've never lost a battle. You've never been defeated. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah to your name. And so, God, we thank you, God, for being here now, God. We thank, thank you that you. we can even feel your, your presence in this atmosphere, yes, God. Lord God. And so, God, we sense that you've got something special you want us to know, God. You've got something you need us to do. So speak now, Lord God. Release a word, Lord God, upon your servant, Lord God. Oh, God, flow freely through him, Lord God. God, if you've got to interrupt our by shaking of a seat, what he had planned and written down, God, have your way because we need to hear from you, Lord God, so that we would know what to do. God, we tell you thank you right now for being God for being God all by yourself. Thank you, Lord God, you. for counting us worthy to be in your presence. Thank you, Lord God, for counting us worthy to be persecuted, Lord God, but yet protected. God, we tell you, thank you right now, God. Ha! We tell you, thank you right now, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. Thank you, God. Hallelujah, God. Blessings and glory and honor. that you're going to do what you plan and purpose to do in this hour. We thank you, Father God, that we will hear testimonies of miracles, signs, and wonders because you yet are doing miracles, signs, and wonders. You open our eyes and our hearts to receive, oh God, what you've already done for us, Lord God. And we tell you, thank you right now. We give you glory and honor in Jesus' name. Amen.
He's God alone. <laughs> All by himself. But he can handle by himself. He said, I am that I am. Mama never used to say, all that I need is in Jesus. Hallelujah, somebody. You are God alone. I praise God for his glory in Psalmist Michael Lee. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah. We'll take you right on into the holies of holies. You can feel the presence of the Lord. Mm. Make you want to take off your shoes because you are the holy ground. Hallelujah, somebody. Mm. Glory. Yeah. Yeah. Um, dominion. Yeah. And power. Yeah, that's the part I like, Joy. Forever. Yeah. And ever. Yeah. So be it. Amen. He's the same yesterday, yes, sir. Yes, sir. today, and forevermore. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Before he created me, he made provisions for me. I heard him tell Jeremiah the other day, I know the plans I have. So stop looking at the circumstances and look at the divine plan of God to bring you to an expected end. Hallelujah. And you better be careful if what you're expecting is not what God is expecting. But if you're expecting what he's expecting, Oh, it's going to be something else. It's going to be something else. I, I used to want what I want, but, but now I, I learned how to want what God wants. So the songwriter the other day said, Lord, do it. I tried it my way and it didn't work, so, so I'm putting it in your hands now. You do it. Whatever you do is all right with me. Because you got all glory. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yes. Dominion yes, and, yes, yes. and power. Mm. Praise God. Hallelujah, somebody. We bless God. We give him glory. We give him honor. And we do give him praise. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, this is a powerful moment. It's a powerful, powerful moment. Yes. What, what excites me now, uh, Priscilla, is that we, we see and we sense what's happening yeah. right now, but, but God is doing a whole lot more yes, he is. Yes, he is. than what we see and what we sense. Yeah. Yeah. Because his ways are not our ways and yeah. his thoughts are not our yeah. thoughts. He is dynamic even yeah. in his presentation yeah. of who he is. And so, so the magnitude of, of what he does, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, the scripture says, eyes haven't seen, ah, mama, mama. ear have not heard. Mm. And, and then he can do exceedingly and abundantly yes, sir. Yes, sir. Above, above all we can think or ask. I, I've been hearing some things and, and people have been asking for special prayers and I've been, I've been praying and, and, and 
wrestling over our young adults and our youth. And, yes, sir. and so every time one of their names pop in my head, I just call their name yes, before yes. the Lord. And I say, God, take control yes. of the situation. Yes, and, and move in their lives like you moved in my life, God. And, and where they're at a place of indecision right now, God, give them a godly decision. Yes. Take the worry away from parents and grandparents so that we don't even have to be concerned about them because we will realize they are in your hands. Yeah, so have your way, God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Have your way, Lord. 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 I want to call your attention very briefly to the 17th chapter of the gospel according to John. John. Uh, chapter 17 and in the 17th chapter of the gospel uh, uh, recorded by uh, Apostle John uh, John takes record and gives record of, of, of uh, the prayer of Jesus our Savior, our mm -hmm. Master, I, I call it the Master's Prayer That's uh, right. and, 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 and so uh, you know, when, when people say, well, I prayed for you. Well, well, Jesus not only prayed for us, but he's in heaven now interceding. Yes. 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 I said he not only prayed for us, but now he's interceding so that everything that he prayed comes to pass. Yes. Uh, yes. Somebody going to get that about 12 o'clock tonight. I said everything that he prayed comes to pass. So he's he's there interceding for us. So we want to take a moment or two to look at the master's prayer. The master's prayer. After saying all these things, John says, Jesus looked up to heaven and said, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your son so he can give glory back to you. For you have given him authority over everyone. I heard, I heard, I heard prophetess praying that, that, that he has all authority. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah, somebody. He gives eternal life to each one that you have given him. Uh, uh, and this is the way to have eternal life. To know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, the one you sent to earth. To know him. Jesus apprises us that, that, that eternal life requires our entering into a personal relationship yes, sir. Yes, sir. with God yes. through Jesus Christ. Yes, when we confess and turn away from our sin, Christ's love lives in us by way of the Holy Spirit. And so we can, God, Jesus said, no man cometh unto the Father except by me. So it is out of knowing God through Jesus Christ our Lord with the help of the Holy Spirit, we gain eternal life. That's right. He says, he goes on, he says, I brought glory to you here on earth by completing the work you gave me to do. Now, Father, bring me into the glory that we shared before the world began. And let me just say that, that in the midst of what Jesus did, bringing glory to God by doing the work of God here on earth, that's also how we bring glory to Jesus is by doing the work of God here on earth. When we do the work of him who has sent us, then we glorify our Father who is in heaven. So we can, we can bring God glory. Now he's glorious in and of himself, but he also can receive greater glory through the work of his children, those that he gave to his son, even Jesus the Christ. He says in verse 6, I have revealed you to the ones you gave me from this world. They were always yours. You gave them to me and they have kept your word. Now 
uh, they know that everything I have is a gift from you. For I have passed on to them the message that you gave to me. They accepted it and know that I came from you and they believe you sent me. My prayer is not for the world, but for those you have given me because they belong to you. All who are mine belong to you. And you have given them to me so they bring me glory. Now I'm departing from the world. They are staying in this world, but I'm coming to you, Holy Father. Holy Father, you have given me your name. Now protect them, oh God, I'm so glad when I read this. I, I said I was so glad when I read this. All the prayers that people have been bombarding me with, and I've been trying to how talk to God about this and that and that yeah. circumstance and that yeah. circumstance. But 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 I'm so glad when I read this. He says, I'm leaving the world, but they are still in the world. I'm coming to you because you've given me my name. Now, God, I want you to protect them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, God, protect them by the power of your name so that they will be united just as we are. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Hallelujah. So, 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 so I'm protected. Yeah. 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 Come on, somebody. I, 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 I don't have a, what that ADA, uh, and I don't yeah. have a, a, a U-verse, uh, ADT, or whatever it is, but, but God protects me. Yeah. 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 Come on, somebody. He never sleeps nor slumbers. He's always, yes. he's always, always on the case. So he is protecting, Hallelujah. he is protecting yes. me you. by his power. Yes. And his protection by his power gives me a mindset to be united with my sisters and brothers in Jesus Christ. Yes. Hallelujah, somebody. During the time, in my time here, Jesus says, I protected them by the power of the name you gave me. I guarded them so that no one was lost except the one headed for destruction as the scriptures foretold. In other words, all that God has predestined to receive salvation through Jesus Christ their Lord, there is nothing that will keep them. Paul says, there is nothing that can separate, oh God, I'm getting this thing, that can separate us from the love of God through Christ Jesus our Lord. Aren't you glad about it that, that, that you know, people break up Husband and wives break up, but there's nothing yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that can separate you from the love of God. Yeah. Thank Hallelujah. Thank Hallelujah. You. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hallelujah. I guarded them so that no one yeah. will be lost. Mm. Now I'm coming to you, Jesus says. I told them many times while I was with them in this world so they would be filled with my joy. I'm going to the Father and there will be greater joy because I go to him because now I can be there firsthand with him interceding for you. I have given them your word, he says, and the world hates them because they do not belong to the world just as I do not belong to this world. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. They, 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 they. He says, he says, let me, let me, I, I ran too quick, I ran too quick. Verse 13, he says, he says, I want them to be filled with my joy. And, 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 and this is the key to immeasurable joy is living close, in close contact with Christ. When we do, we will experience God's special care and protection and see the victory God brings even when defeat seems to be certain. Yes, thank you. Oh, help us, man. Help us right there. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, what, 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 what are you trying to tell us about? What I'm trying to tell you is that when it looked like things not going to work out, yeah. when it appears that this sickness will be unto death, God says, Jesus says, no, no, there is special care that I have provided for you and the special care leads to special
special protection and, and when it looks like defeat, it will be victory. Yes. 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 I, I said when it looks like defeat, it will be victory. So, so, so don't you get uptight about things looking like you're going to be defeated because the looks of defeat means victory for the household of faith. Yeah, praise the Lord, somebody. It's victory for the household of faith. I'm not asking you to take them out of the world, but to keep them safe from the evil one. Hallelujah, somebody. They do not belong to this world any more than I do. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's why the world is against us. Jesus said they hated me, they're going to hate you. Uh -huh. uh, because we are, we, we are supposed to be establishing a greater standard uh, and challenging, challenging the standards of the world. And the world don't like it because they like doing what they're doing. But those of the household of faith, we are to establish a greater standard. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. yeah. We are to establish a greater standard. Uh -huh. uh, make them holy uh -huh. by your truth. Yes. Wow. Teach them your word, which is truth. Sanctify them by the truth. Uh -huh. As they hear the truth and receive the truth, the truth will sanctify them and make them holy. Yes. Yes. That's how we become holy. Yes. Saints is walking by the truth of God. Yes. The word of God. Set them apart for your purposes. Make them holy, Jesus asks of the Father. Just as you sent me into the world, I'm sending them into the world. And I give myself as a holy sacrifice for them so they can be made holy by your truth. Again, set them apart. Dedicate them. Make them holy. Let them be made holy. Let the stuff that they go through as they walk by faith and not by sight, let it add to the holiness that they're supposed to be walking in. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm not praying only for these disciples. Uh, I got excited again. But also for all who will ever believe in me through this message. I'm just not praying for the disciples. John and Peter and James. I'm not just praying for them. But I'm praying for everyone who will believe that I'm the son of God. That I died on an old rugged cross to save them from their sins. And on the third day, Father, you raised me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Hallelujah. I'm praying for all the saints. Uh, I said I'm praying for all the, all the saints. Hallelujah. Jesus crossed the aisle. I was looking at the, 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 the Democratic Convention last night. And they talked about, about, about how, how Biden had... The, the notion of crossing the aisle and, and making friends with Republicans in order to get the greater good done for the nation. And, 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 and when they asked Jesus, did you just come for us Jews? He said, no, I came that the world might be saved. Yes, yes. For, for it will be written that God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believed in him should not perish but have everlasting, Hallelujah. everlasting life. He goes on, he says, I pray that they will be one. Uh -huh. Just as you and I are one. In the same manner, let them be one. Let them love one another. Let them be in support of one another. Let them yield strength one to another. When one is weak, let another be strong so that they can walk together in union and as sisters and brothers in Jesus Christ and be sustained in the dire of moments. Praise uh, God. Let them be, be one. And may they be in us so that the world will believe that you sent me. I have given them the glory that you gave to me. What? Say, wait a minute, what you say, Jesus? I have, that, I, I'm reading this right now. 
I have given them the glory you gave me so they may be one as we. In other words, you know, but I just don't like Linda. Well, you might not be a child of God. Because Jesus says, I've given you enough glory. Come on, somebody. So you can love your sister and love your brother in Jesus Christ. And if you can't get along with them, something wrong with you. Come on. I mean, that's a powerful statement. I've given them my glory. Jesus says, I have extracted of my own character and my own loving nature, and I've given it to Michael Lee so Michael can love his neighbor. Yeah. Lord have mercy. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that they can be, they can be one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, they can be one. Father, I walk. Uh, these whom you have given me to be with me where I am. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. yeah. Then they can see all the glory that you gave me because you loved me even before the world began. Oh, righteous Father, the world doesn't know you, but I know you. And these disciples know that you sent me and I have revealed you to them and I will continue to do so. Then your love for me will be in them and I will be in them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody. And I will be in them. So, so, so the master was praying for us. And then, then, then I'm, I'm almost through. I'm almost through. Almost through. Uh, uh, this look, look at Hebrews 14 and I mean, excuse me, Hebrews 4 and 14. Uh, and I'm gonna read 14 through 16, but but I'm gonna read this from the Amplified Bible. Hebrews chapter 4, verses 14 through 16 in the Amplified Bible. And, 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 and I hope it blows your mind like it blew my mind. Uh -huh. Listen to this. In so much in as much then as we believers have a great high priest uh -huh. who has <clears throat> excuse me already ascended and passed through the heavens Jesus the son of God let us hold fast our confession yes, yes. of our of faith and cling tenaciously tenaciously to our absolute trust in him as our savior he doesn't say a whole, but hold tenaciously. Mm -hmm. that, that means if anything comes and try to tear you away from him, you ready to fight. No, no, it's like trying to take a bone from a dog. Uh -huh. No, you in for a fight. Uh, but it's my dog. That's okay. You in for a fight. Yeah. You're in for a fight because they will be tenacious when they find something that they want and, and you try to take it away. Hello, somebody. And, and I don't know what you found, but, but that Tuesday night. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Yeah, I found yeah. something. I, yeah. I found something. That, and, and, and I'm tenacious about it now because it has blessed me all the days of my life. Yes, yes. yes. All the days of my life. And I'm tenacious about it. Hallelujah, somebody. Uh, and put all of my trust in him as my Savior. He goes on, he says, For we do not have a high priest who is unable to sympathize and understand our weakness and temptations, but one who has been tempted knowing exactly how it feels to be human uh -huh. in every respect as we are yet without committing any sin uh -huh. and Jesus said if I did it with the help of the Holy Spirit you can do it mm -hmm. yes. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. yeah you can do it you can go a day uh, without uh, having a conflict uh, with your neighbor. Uh -huh. yeah. You can go a day without having a conflict with your sister or brother in the church house uh, because they didn't recognize that you was on the committee too. Yeah. 
Hello, somebody. Uh, I mean, we let little stuff trip us up. It's no big thing that, that we, we don't murder nobody, but we do little stuff that really messes us up. But Jesus says that I understand your weaknesses and, and I understand the temptations that you go through because I went through the same temptation. The Bible says there is not any temptation that is given unto man that Christ did not overcome. Therefore, let us with privilege approach the throne of God's grace. That's why, that's why the King James says, come boldly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. You have been granted, yes, yes. you have been given yes. a divine privilege. Yes. And if that ain't enough authority for you to yes. come yes. boldly before the throne of grace, I don't know what is. If, yes. if, if the one who sits on the throne yes. tell you you can come to the throne and you still stay away. says let us with privilege uh -huh. you, 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 you're, not, you're not coming somewhere nobody asked you to come you know you, you, you know when you used to bust we used to bust in a house party and somebody said well man you weren't even invited to this party and we just bust in uh -huh. yeah, yeah. come on somebody oh, but oftentimes somebody was there bigger than you that pushed you back out come on somebody but, but, but if God says you can yeah. come yeah. before the throne of his grace yeah. who that can turn you away. Yes, yes. So we come with privilege and approach the throne of God's grace. That is the throne of God's gracious favor with confidence and without fear so that we may receive mercy for our failures. Ah, uh, doesn't that sound good? Mercy for our failures and find his amazing Grace to help in time of need and appropriate blessing coming just at the right moment. Yes, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. When I read that, I, you know, sometimes people can bless you, but the blessing ain't what you need, Paul. Mm -hmm. You know, and they make such a big deal. Well, I gave him so much, so much, and you'd be like, but I need it. But God says that, that when I bless you, yes. the blessings will be appropriate yes. to, me. Yes. to what you yes. what you need. Yes. See, you shouting over your car, yes. and I'm shouting about I can go to Kroger yes. and check out without having to put <laughs> Hello, somebody. See, see, you, you, you got to deal with what's appropriate. You know, you, you, you shouting about your new uh, uh, five bedroom house, yeah, yeah. and I'm thinking for the apartment yeah. that I, oh God, that I finally got enough money. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. See, you, 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 you shouting and testifying about making. Sixty, seven, eighty thousand uh, dollars uh, uh, a year, uh -huh. and, and I'm I'm grateful that that I got a yes, sir. come on somebody a thirty thousand uh, dollar job, yeah, because I didn't have a job for three or four years. Come on somebody, and, and God blessed me. He saw me at the point of my need, and and they told me I wasn't gonna pass the interview. They, you you. But, but if you get one, I don't think you're going to pass. But lo and behold, yeah, yeah, yeah. God sent a blessing yeah. that was appropriate yeah. for my situation. Yeah. And I got the job and haven't been there six months and they gave me a promotion. Hallelujah. Wow. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, he knows how to give appropriate, yeah. appropriate blessing. He's our He's our high priest. Uh -huh. I said he's our, our high priest. You see, the high priest in Old Testament days only went into the holies of holies one time out of a year. Come on, somebody. Now, 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 now that kind of scares me because what that tells me 
me is that if I need a blessing, uh -huh. yeah. let's just say I need a blessing in January, uh -huh. and the priest don't go in until April. Uh -huh. Come on, somebody. <laughs> and, and, and I go to the priest, and, and I tell the priest what my need is, and the priest said, well, when April comes, uh -huh.
for the gracious favor of your amazing grace. Thank you, Lord. So I can come with confidence and without fear. Hallelujah. And tell you just how it is. I don't have to sugarcoat it. I don't have to camouflage it. I can tell it just like it is. The God that I serve with his amazing grace, his mercy, hallelujah, somebody, and his goodness can receive me and bless me just like he wants to. Hallelujah, somebody. Showers. 
say this. Say this and I'm through. A few weeks ago, the guy that he's my lawn and chapter the really sprays the yard. He sprayed it and he said, Reverend Lee now. I put down some stuff to kill. Oh boy, that's a whole other blessing. Mm -hmm. To kill the weeds. And I'm seeing this, y'all. I'm seeing, I'm seeing this. That every now and again, God will send something your way. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. To kill the stuff that's trying to kill you. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Lord. Yeah. Thank you, God. You'll do it. Thank you, God. So that you can thrive like you're supposed to be thriving. Yes. Yeah. Thank you, God. Mm -hmm. But he said, now, Reverend, you're going to have to water at least every other day. Come on, come on. For about 25 or 30 minutes. Come on, come on. <laughs> and I said, okay. You know how we are. I said, well, if I water every other day, then the water bill. Come on. Come on. Come on. See, God, that's why God can't bless us sometimes. We worry about something that He already know how to take. The water bill. Come on. Yeah, yeah. I said, but I wanted to kill this stuff that needs to be killed. And so I got up the next one. He said, start tomorrow. I got up the next one. And I put the sprinklers out, turned them on, and timed it. I don't have to do it tomorrow because he said every other day. But the third day. Come on, come on, what did he do? Uh -huh. Come on, what did he do? When, when I was supposed to be watering. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, God. It was raining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I said, thank you, Lord. And after it rained, the sun came out. Uh -huh. And by the time the sun went down, you could even tell except for the ground that it had. Uh -huh. But I still said, well, I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. So the day after tomorrow, uh -huh. thank you, Lord. Uh -huh. Thank you, Lord. Yes, yes. And there are times when God sprays your stuff. Because yeah, 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 yeah. there's some stuff, Michael, that needs to be killed out. Yeah. Oh my God. But he knows that although I'm killing some stuff, yeah, 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 yeah. you still need some showers yeah. uh -huh. of blessings. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. 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 And so, don't be uptight about what he's killing off. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because there will be showers. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Thank you, Just yes, sir. when you need it. Yeah. At the appropriate moment, the scripture says. Yeah. God will come Thank you. Thank you. and refresh your life. Yeah. Thank you. Hallelujah, somebody. I don't know about you, but, but, but my life at times, it can stand some refreshing. But God can do it. God can do it. So God, we thank you for right now. Hey, yeah. We thank you for right now. We thank you for every blessing. Blessings we've already enjoyed. But according to the word, there are blessings yet to come. Yeah, yeah. So God, since you've been so good to us, we're not going to wait till the blessings come. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. We're going to tell you thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Right now. Thank you, Lord. Yes, hallelujah. Because you are faithful. Yes, you are, God. Yes, you are, God. Thank you, Lord. Yes. 
You are faithful. You are faithful. So God, we thank you for your blessings that are even yet to come. And then God, give us a mindset so that when we have the opportunity to be a blessing for somebody else, that we will be exactly that. Because that's your character, that's your nature. And we know now that that's how we glorify you is by living life like you lived it. Yeah. And being a blessing in the lives of someone else. Thank you, oh God, we bless your name today. Jesus. 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 Thank you, Lord. For loving us the way that you do. Thank you, God, for making preparations for us. Even before we were in our mother's womb. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So now we know that if you take care of us today, tomorrow is nothing for you to do. Because you are the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. So God, we thank you. Thank you, Lord. And we're in the hands of your son. And you have given him power. Yes, yes, sir. So that none that is in his hand, yeah, yeah. the enemy is able to pluck out. Yeah, thank you, so we thank you now. Thank you, Jesus. In the mighty name of thank you, Jesus. Yes. So God, we pray you be with these, your people. Yes, sir. Bless them. Give them the faith to believe that they have an intercessor and his name is Jesus. Give them the faith to believe, oh God, that if they have not given their lives to him, they can do it even right now. Yes, yes, God, yes. He would receive them unto himself. Their names would be written in the Lamb's book of life. Yes, oh Lord. So God, walk with us daily. Keep us in your care and in your holy divine keeping. God, I lift up Liz Hobson to you. I don't have to tell you about her. You know the circumstances. You know the situation. You're already in the healing process. Oh God, come even the more with showers of blessings that she would stand forth even again to bless and exalt and to praise your holy and righteous name. I lift up her daughters and her grandkids to you. I lift up her mother and I pray that you give them the courage that they need to see this thing through. God, as you move, we're going to be careful to give your name praise and to give your name Glory. I lift up Teresa Baker. You cast the devil out.
God, we go to sanctify that dwelling. We're going to anoint every door, every window. Amen. 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 And amen.